it just smells so good. Like, Welcome back to my channel. My name is Narcisse. If you guys are new here today, we're going to be talking about all things Bath and Body Works. So as you can see right behind me, I have all of my empties from, I'll say like the past couple of months. I have everything from aromatherapy to like sweeter scents to more manly uh, masculine scents. So I wanted to talk to you guys about all of my favorite products from Bath & Body Works and if you know, you know, semi-annual sales started yesterday. I really wanted to get this video out on the same day that the semi-annual sales started but just didn't work out like that for you girl but it's okay, we're here now. Now I don't want to hold you too long but I want to show you guys what I have and what I'm loving and then I also want to talk to you guys about what I'll be picking up from the semi-annual sale. Hopefully I don't do too much damage, but you know, if you know, you know, I got a candle cabinet over there. These are my empties. You can only imagine how many candles I go through. But without further ado, let's just get right into the video. Okay, so the first candle that I have here, this is one of the single wick candles. I typically don't buy single wick candles just because I don't necessarily feel like they're worth the money. But this is one either I got it as a gift or I got it like when it was like on super sale. This is actually a thousand wishes and it smells so, so, so good. Notes in it are sparkling champagne, crystal peonies, and almond crema. It smells really, really good. It's like more of a sweeter scent but you can really smell like the champagne in it it kind of reminds me of champagne toast just a little bit but it smells really really good i like this one i use this i remember in my bathroom at my old place but this one smells really really good and it's kind of like just like a refreshing type scent i would definitely recommend this one if you can pick it up from the semi-annual sale i would this is a uh, highly recommend for me the next candle I have here is like my fave. Oh my God. Strawberry pound cake is my absolute fave. I'm gonna smell every one of them like I've never smelled them before. Oh my God, it smells so good. So the notes in this one are fresh strawberries, golden shortcake, and whipped cream. This really smells like a strawberry pound cake. Like there's no other way to describe it but strawberry pound cake. It smells so good. Like it smells like a summer day and you come inside and you have a strawberry pound cake like my mama used to make for me. This is a fave of mine. Like I like to light this just kind of when I want to feel cozy. I don't know why this gives me cozy warm feelings but it really really does and it smells so good. Like this is my fave. I didn't burn this candle until I could buy a full candle, the full uh, three wick candle, because I didn't wanna not have this candle anymore. So yeah, this tops here, and I have two of them in my candle, candle cabinet. <laughs> the next thing, these are all three wicks. This is what I usually buy. Now let me tell y'all something. I usually do not buy candles period from Bath & Body Works unless they're on sale preferably under ten dollars so usually like a sale like this like semi-annual sale or candle day is another time where I really buy candles or if they are like maybe 12 they're on sale for like 12 25 or whatever and then I have a coupon let me tell y'all something about these coupons that I just found out myself I did not know this but if you get coupons in the mail on the back there's a code for online and then there's a code for in store so you can use your coupons two times so say they send you three coupons you can use each one of those coupons two times so that's really six times you can use your coupon i did not know that until just like probably a month or so ago but I was trying to take advantage of a sale and I asked my friends in my Facebook group, shout out to y'all, uh, 
if I could do that. And they were like, yeah, girl, we do it all the time. So what you would wanna do, what I would advise you to do is shop online first. And I would also advise you, if your store has online pickup, I would advise you to shop online, pick up in store so you don't have to pay shipping fees and you don't have to worry about your package getting lost and you don't have to worry about FedEx breaking your candles and go pick it up in the store. And then when you go pick it up in the store or before your coupon expires, just shop again. So that way you're kind of buying, you're kind of getting your bang for your buck twice. And if you ask me, your girl real bougie on a budget. So I love a good coupon. I love a good uh, sale. So anyways, I just wanted to kind of throw that out there. But anyway, this is Black Cherry Mer Merlot. This is like a classic. Like this has always been one of my favorite scents. It smells so good. And all of these still have like a little wax at the end. What I'm about to do after this video is uh, get all of the wax out and I'm gonna make wax melts. The fragrance notes in this candle are dark cherry, black raspberry, sumptuous merlot with essential oils. This is actually a white barn candle. I, I thought I had a theory that white barn was better than Bath and Body Works, but I've recently experienced some of my white barn candles not being the best. And I think I just actually got a bad batch of candles. So try them out. Make sure that you're smelling them in store. And if you're buying them blind, make sure to read the reviews or join the Facebook group I'm in and ask the fellow Facebookers that are in love with Bath and Body Works as much as you are. But yeah, Black Cherry Merlot is like, it's a classic. It's sweet. It smells like sexy in a sense. Like it's one of those nighttime relaxing. I just had a bowl bath spa day. I'm about to get it in. You need this. Black Cherry Merlot. The next one is Pineapple Mango. So I got this one. I want to say I probably got this like last summer because it has like the summer beachy packaging. This pineapple mango is just fresh pineapple juice, mango, vine ripened raspberries, and essential oil. It smells, it smells really good. It's just, it's just like if you think of like a pineapple mango juice, this that's exactly what this smells like. If you've ever had, okay, so if you've ever had mimosas on a Sunday at home with simply pineapple mango juice and champagne, prosecco, whatever, that is what this candle smells like. I think that it's perfect for like a bathroom scent. It's a little lighter to me. So I would definitely like use this in the bathroom, but it smells really, really good. I also would highly recommend this one. It's bomb. This aromatherapy relax candle. So I probably bought this one last year as well, but this is my very first time trying out the relax candle. The relax candle is the black chamomile with essential oil. The notes in it is bergamot oil, which calms the mind and the body, and then chamomile oil, which creates a sense of well-being. So this is actually one of the candles, again, that I like to burn at nighttime when I'm doing like a spa night, like when I just really want to, like they said, relax before I'm getting ready to go to bed and I really just need to like calm my nerves, calm my body all the way down. This is like, this was like a go-to candle for me. I haven't seen this one in the stores lately. So I don't know if they still have this relax one, but I really, really liked it. And it's, it's aromatherapy. So it's like, it's really, it's really sensual. It really just helps you it does what aromatherapy is supposed to do. So if you can get your hands on this one to at least smell it, I would. Uh, some of the aromatherapy, the smell is like, mm, I just really don't like the smell of that. This is not one of them. So I had to go ahead and pick this one up. This one and the stress for relief are amongst my faves. The next candle is Raspberry Tangerine. This one is so bomb as well. It's a sweet scent and it's kind of, like I can, I can smell it just doing this. The notes in this one are wild raspberries, fresh tangerine, lemon zest, and essential oils. This is one I like to burn for like the whole house or like to put in the kitchen and let it just, you know, just take over the whole house. It, this one is really, really strong. I like this one. This was also one that I probably bought last summer or at the end of summer. It just smells so good. Like, if you can get your hands on this one, grab this one as well because it's bomb. 
it smells so good and it smells like so fresh and so summery and if you notice like a pattern here i really love sweet scents so here we are <laughs> okay y'all the next scent is pink lilac and vanilla i just recently discovered this like i don't know just maybe a few months ago but this this is like <laughs> This is so good. It's really soft. It's a soft scent. It's not extremely loud, but it's a soft scent, but it penetrate like it, uh, what's the word that I'm looking for? The throw. The throw of this one is, is far. It is, this is an amazing scent. But like I said, it's really soft, but it has an amazing throw. Fresh Lilac Bouquet, Dewy Greens, Vanilla Blossom, and Essential Oils. This also is a white barn candle, but I would rebuy this. If you can get a hold of it for the semi-annual sale, I would definitely grab it. But it, this, this one is like, it's such a soft scent. And I would usually burn this like on the weekends when I'm just at home chilling or I'm doing laundry or something like that. It just, it, it kind of makes you feel relaxing. And I'm pretty sure that's the essential oils in it but this one is this is it this one is bomb so aloha kiwi passion fruit this is my girl i know i'm gonna say it. i feel like i'm about to say that about all of these candles but this right here is my girl so last year if you go back to my very first vlogs from last year you will see this candle with a different packaging but i definitely had this candle uh, one of these candles last year and when I smelled it for the first time I was like oh my god I fell in love I burned it so quickly I was upset with myself and then this was like in the midst of quarantine where there was like it ain't no shopping you ain't getting no more candles like nothing when I got my hands on this one I had to buy like two more just so that I can have a backup the same way with the strawberry pound cake it smells it smells so, it smells like, it smells like beach a little bit. Like, I've never been to Hawaii. It's on my bucket list. But the, the notes are tropical passion fruit, radiant kiwi, juicy pineapple, and essential oils. It's the kiwi. Yeah, it, it gotta be the kiwi for me. Like, it's gotta be the kiwi. This one is a banger for summertime and just for yeah you you gotta grab this one this one is this one is really really good i had to buy this like i said two at a time but it's the kiwi i think it's really strong so if you don't like kiwi i guess i wouldn't go for this one but i really like kiwi i like to eat kiwi and i like the smell of kiwi so yeah i would definitely go for this especially in the candle and y'all all of these recommendations that i'm giving i'm solely speaking on candles i'm not speaking on any of the body care i don't buy any of the uh body care from bath and body works anymore aside from the aromatherapy from the aromatherapy line i still buy the shower gels like the body scrubs the bath salts stuff like that but i just don't buy the signature collections or any of these like fruitier lines i just feel like I've kind of outgrown them a little bit. So I don't buy them anymore personally, so I can't speak to how they smell as a body lotion or a spray or the body cream. Okay, you know what, I take that back. I do still buy the, some of the body creams, some of them, not all of them, but the body sprays and like the regular lotions, I don't buy those anymore. So like I said, all of my recommendations that I'm giving you for these scents are solely for the candles. The body care as far as like the mist and the actual body creams, I don't personally buy them anymore, but the smell is essentially the same. I just don't know how they wear. All right. Juicy pink grapefruit. Okay, so I just recently picked this up like a couple months ago when I was doing like a lot of candle shopping. This one, the notes are sugared grapefruit, juicy peach, fresh mango blossoms, and natural essential oils. I liked it. Uh, I'm not... Okay, so I've never really just been like into grapefruity stuff, like grapefruit juice or the actual grapefruit. So I got this because it was like a little different and it was like a more of a summery scent. It is sweet. It does smell really good. 
It does have a little citrusy in it, which I'm sure is from like the grapefruit. Um, I wouldn't say that it smells bad because it doesn't. It actually smells really good. It's just not one that I would automatically like reach for, especially given the name. But when I smelled it, I was like, I, you know what? Let me try this out. Let me take a chance on it. And I really, really do like it. So with that being said, if this is on a semi-annual sale, I personally, I went on the website yesterday morning whenever they first sent out the email, but I didn't shop. I just kind of scrolled and I was like, not yet, <laughs> not yet. I haven't really gone through the website with a fine tooth comb, nor have I been in store yet. So if you find this Juicy Pink Grapefruit, I would definitely try it out. I, I like it. I think that it smells really, really good. So I would definitely try that one out. Okay, the next one is Midnight Blue Citrus. Okay, this one is more masculine in a sense. Like it's more of a, it's not sweet at all. The notes in it are, well damn, where are the notes? Oh, okay, here they are. The notes in it are juicy citrus, fresh spring water, and sweet mango. Okay, so the notes sound sweet, but it's it's not sweet. Like, to me, I feel like it, it's more, it gives like a masculine kind of smell. Um, I think just mainly because of like the juicy citrus and the fresh spring water, like sweet mango is the last thing that they have here. So, I don't know. You just, you just have to smell this. But to me, this doesn't smell, this doesn't smell sweet at all. It definitely gives me more of a masculine vibe. So again, this is one that I would use like kind of at nighttime, getting ready for bed or, you know, if you have a man around or whatever. This is probably one that he would like and that he would approve of and not like the other ones that are kind of too sweet. But I really like this one. It was a lighter scent if you ask me, but I think that it was a really great candle and it was like a refreshing candle, which is again, I think that probably came from the fresh spring water. All right, the next one is Peach Bellini. The notes in this are succulent white peach, sparkling Prosecco, sweet orange, and essential oils. Peach Bellini, I feel like, is like a crowd pleaser. Like, I think Peach Bellini is just one of the ones that you can't necessarily go wrong with, which is why I really, really like this one. Uh, ooh. It smells really good. <laughs> It smells really good. It kind of reminds me of like brunch, summertime, like it's a fresh scent. It has the white peach, the Prosecco, the sweet orange. Like it's it's a really sweet scent, but it also has like the, the citrusy kind of undertones to it, which I really like. Like I said, Peach Bellini, like you really just can't go wrong with it. So this is one of my faves. It's one that I always go to. Like if you're ever shopping and you're like, I need one more candle, it's, it's something like this that I would pick up because I know that I really, really like it. Tiki Beach is the next one, and this one, I'm not gonna lie to you, I didn't really have the greatest experience with it. It didn't, the throw for this one was not very strong. I'm not sure if I just got a bad candle, which is, which definitely could be a possibility and I just didn't realize, but the notes in it are warm vanilla musk, orchids, toasted coconut, and essential oils. the vanilla musk the orchids and the toasted coconut not so much but I don't know it's just the throw wasn't that strong for me the scent was great but it's just the throw wasn't that strong for me like I said in my Facebook group my friends in my little Facebook group they always say that this one is a really good candle it has a nice throw I just didn't experience a nice throw but I, like I said I would definitely try it out it smells really good it's just the throw for me wasn't there. And so I ended up keeping this one like in a confined space, like a bathroom with the door shut, all of that. Okay, these are the last ones, y'all. This is Mahogany Teakwood High Intensity, the classics of the classic. I used to wear Bath and Body Works, like the body cares and stuff like that. Mahogany Teakwood lotion was like my fave. Like it's masculine, but I don't, I don't know, I would still wear it. Like. I really, really enjoy Mahogany Teakwood. This is one of the ones, again, that I would light at night, like because it, it's a masculine, relaxing smell. 
if you have a man around this is one that i'm sure that he would love if you want to gift it to him for father's day hint hint this is a good one high intensity go ahead and go with the high intensity the throw is amazing on the high intensity and if you like kind of get sensitive to to smells maybe try just the regular one to start off with the high intensity it's gonna light your entire house i promise you the notes in this one are black teak wood dark oak frosted lavender and essential oils it just this is the one this is definitely the one it smells really good it smells manly it's like relaxing it's just it's there this is the one that you definitely need if you don't try nothing else i would definitely try this if you like that type of high in high intensity teak wood type of woodsy smell this is the one the next one is raspberry mimosa this one smells really good as well it's a mimosa so it's more of a sweeter citrusy type scent the notes in it are sweet raspberries rose sorbet a splash of champagne and essential oils super super sweet this one is also a white barn i don't think i mentioned that one for the mahogany teak wood but it smells really really good it has a great throw like an amazing throw this is something that you can put in the kitchen or in the living room and it's gonna light your entire house try this one out if you can but any of the raspberry uh scented ones smell really really good to me last but definitely not least watermelon lemonade this is the epitome of summertime like it smells so fresh it smells so sweet this is watermelon ice sparkling water Meyer lemon it smells so good like this is another one that has an amazing throw you can put it in your living room you can put it in your kitchen you can put it in your bedroom wherever and the throw is going to be amazing i usually would like this like in the bedroom or in the living room area or like on the dining room table and just let it light the entire house this one is again i think a really good one for someone who likes sweet scents someone who likes something that's a little fresher and then also someone who likes something with a good throw this is one of my absolute favorites i really really like this one so if you can get your hands on this one for the semi-annual sale i definitely would i'm pretty sure all of these scents are included in the semi-annual sale because they're more of the summery scents those are the scents that i tend to gravitate to i'm gonna keep checking the website i'm gonna keep adding stuff to my cart if you guys do decide to make purchases make sure that you're going back and you're checking the website because they add new stuff every day i'm gonna let you guys know what i purchase as far as candles go but down in the comments make sure to let me know what you guys are purchasing which since you guys liked which since you guys didn't like so i'm thinking about doing a part two to this video let me know if that's something that you guys would even like down in the comments and i will see you guys in my next one bye